by the fun place. More information will follow shortly. Please prepare accordingly. Eh? The fun place? WTF? Inside the behind the scenes, magazine show, everybody! Episode 17, Inside Simo. With me, Kimball. And me, Peter. We've got a packed show today. We've got start of the year 2022. We've got the premiere of the Fighty Girls up the Ark. And Chris and Lynn will be back. For telling your future. Guys, we just had a phone call. God, who was? They said they were the fun police. They said they were coming to Simon's. Oh, oh, the founders. <laughs> to start with, let's take a look at the start of the year 2022. Lisa. Where are we going, Lisa? Sam Bokers. Four. Start of the year. Star of the year, Lisa. Yeah. 2022. Yeah. Is this, is this my gym? Yeah. <laughs> Which one's his bedroom? Are you happy? Oh, he's up there, isn't he? Anymore. We switched to start of the month to give people more of a chance to win. The f- oh, first one, it was clear. Oh, David was not happy. Are you a bit upset that you haven't won? Because mm. why? He why? said, um, declare a fat cow. <laughs> he didn't. He did. He's, he thinks that's what? Declare, declare. David. I do say fat. You say <laughs> cow. You called her a cow. That's what I said. Just called her a cow. Yes. You don't really think that, though, do you? No. No. Well done, Claire. Another feisty girl wins. And speaking of the feisty girls, they recently did a live show at the Ark in Stockton. They were a big hit. <laughs> We 
are going to be uh, doing a live stream thing for our video right now, and it's in eight seconds. Six, five, five four, three, two, one. one. Yeah, we're all excited. Simon has decided to get with the programme and have a go at a live premiere of the Feisty Girls' latest concert movie. Two of our greatest hits, Bad Boy in the Rain and Talk To Me. Oh, we have a comment. We've got a ha-ha. 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 We've been trying to get the Simo YouTube channel more views and subscribers and hoped that it would help to reach out and make direct contact with our audience. On the day, we had three people waiting for the premiere to begin and we were chuffed that people were starting to comment. Claire from Pretty Lady is a good typer and was in charge of the chat. I well said, done. I said, goodbye everyone on the line and thank you for the coming for the fancy girls. Well done. Woo! Woo! Well done, girl. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't. So tell me, what do you think of live premieres then? Is it something that you would like to keep up? Yes, what? I would. Yeah. Yeah? Absolutely. Was it exciting watching people commenting? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really yeah. yeah. Gets, it gives you a chance to get to know the audience a bit more, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Well done, everyone. See you yeah. There was another unexpected hit at the show. Unexpected tit, more like. I'm doing a video of uh, John making a pattern of himself. Well, man, after all the show, mate, all the men wanted to be me, and all the ladies wanted to be with me. Ooh. Stop pissing them out. <laughs> What's going on? I don't know something about a visit from the police. The police? Mm. Go and eat your wig. Everything all right? What's the matter? Bum police have found us, haven't they? Are we going to get on with the show? We haven't gone through the window yet. Oh, no, you are. You've got to be joking me, Kaz. Not the fun police. Dell's losing it. This is supposed to be the best kept secret in all of our talk. No, no, no. Stop this. I don't... I mean, did you... Are you the one who's told them? No, I just can't... <laughs> He's running the toilet, crying like a big fat baby. Oh, don't be so, so Peter. Yes, Peter. So what one do you like to go for, Peter? I think I have the wrong window, Peter. Oh, anything for you, handsome. Oh, saucy. Oh, get a rummy cup of bear vets. Welcome, fans of the future. It is me, Crystal Lynn. Today, I will gaze into my crystal ball to see the future. James Reed, dead me, Crystal Lynn. What's my fortune? He asked. Well, let me peer through the veil. I see. A knock at the door, James. Blue light and a warrant. I see a woman shouting, Run, James, run! Then gunshots. Then finally, silence. <gasps> it is not for me to interpret these visions of the future. I cannot say what they mean. But if I were you, James, I'd start deleting my internet search history. <laughs> we also have requests of Tom Tom 
John Doe and Christopher Camilleri. But what I saw in their futures, I dare not repeat. All I will say is shame. Shame on you all, you dirty bloody guests. <laughs> now, I have one final prediction, and it's for Simo itself. Dark clouds are gathering as she approaches. Prepare accordingly. Again, I cannot say what these visions portend. I am but a simple soothsayer. But if I was Stafford Simo, I'd start looking for a new job. I suppose that's the end of the show. See you next time. If there is a next time. <laughs> <laughs>